Hey baby dolls, it's me Monique. Okay, thank you for coming back. And so this is part two of my massive haul. You guys, I am so, so happy to be getting all of this done. You just don't know. It's like when you have all of the things that you, you collect for, you know, you shop one week and you put the stuff aside, you know, it's just like sitting a little in a little corner of your room. And it's like, if you're like me, you have to have everything like perfect in its place. And so, yeah, it's been bugging me just to have this stuff sit. And so now I get to put it away. I am so excited. It's my birthday. I'm excited about that. I'm going to the Caribbean. I'm so excited about that. And so it's really, really a phenomenal phenomenal time and also you guys Zumba is still impeccable I'm getting more involved in it I actually did uh, join a dance troupe and we've been dancing on stage in front of like hundreds of people and so I've got some video footage of that for you as well so check back sometime in November and I will show you some pictures and things of what I've been doing it's just really a really phenomenal time for me right now and I thank God but anyway let's go ahead and finish this haul so I can go ahead and do more stuff okay again hello to all of my baby dolls new and old how are you doing I hope that you're blessed you are blessed if you are watching me because that means you are in the land of the living okay <laughs> all right so let's go ahead and finish up the haul so uh, big lots, big lots, big lots. Your girl loves big lots. Okay, so they have these makeup brushes. And I had already purchased one a couple of weeks ago. And it is by this brand called London Soho. Really awesome brand, okay? So here's the one brush that I had already showed you. They're $2.50. This is a blending brush, which is really neat about these brushes is because it has like little grooves where you can put your, your finger just rests so nicely in the groove. And so you're able to just really work nicely with these brushes. They just, they're so nice. They're really high tech. Okay, so I got that blending brush. I got this one. It's called the Angled Blender Brush. It's an angled brush. And I believe the fibers are basically synthetic, but they do feel like natural hair. But I, I, it, they do look like they're synthetic brushes. So there's that brush. Then I got the All Over Shadow Brush, um, which I'm going to have to take it out thing here so you can see it. But this is what the All Over Eyeshadow Brush looks like. Wow, they feel so fabulous. Wow, this one is a love. I love it. It feels so good. And with this, even though this is eyeshadow brush, right? As you can see, it's big enough. You could really use it for highlighting as well. Really cool. I'm going to have to go back and get another one of those babies. Those are really, really nice. All right, so there's that. And then last but not least, I got the concealer brush. You can never have too many concealer brushes because concealer brushes get dirty fast and it's almost like once they get the makeup stuck in them, they're really never the same anymore. So having several concealer brushes is always a good deal, especially if you are um, conscious about your skin and, you know, good skin health. Uh, but yeah, this is nice. Concealer. Yeah, I like it. Oh yeah, very nice. So two fifty a big lot cannot be that. All right. Then y'all know that I do do makeup on the side as a little hobby that I get paid for, but it's a hobby nonetheless. But anyway, I'm always like doing like avant garde looks and things like that. And so they have these lip glosses for two dollars at Big Lots. I had never heard of this brand before. Neon Lip Gloss is basically all it, it says. I had never heard of the brand before, but I wanted to go ahead and try it out. Ladies, the color is opaque, believe it or not. And this is what the tube looks like. Very nice and sleek. 
Okay. So here's a green. Beautiful. I mean, I don't know many people that's going to want to wear green lips, but, you know, like I said, avant-garde looks and then also um, costume parties and things like that. It's going to be right up somebody's alley. So there is that. Very, very opaque color. And I tried this one on and I love I wish they made these glosses just in regular colors because I love the texture of these lip glosses. Really, really nice. I love them. And what I kind of liked about wearing it, um, it kind of gave like an ombre effect. So it was like it had green, right? But then, of course, uh, the pink part of my lip showed through. So it almost looked like watermelon or something like that. It really gave a really cool effect. And so these are really... I'd say definitely go for them, especially if you're a makeup artist and you want to add some kind of cool things into your kit. These these are worth it, definitely. All right. And then I got some Colormate lip glosses. So this one is called Starlet. And Starlet is basically a beautiful, bright coral color. These were $1.50. I got them because the packaging was so cute. See this? So cute. So this one is pink and this one is called Diva. And this is what it looks like here in the front. And I'm going to do a swatch of this for you. Smells very nice. The consistency again is opaque. People are really coming up. These companies are coming up with their products nowadays. So there is the pink. Uh-oh, Skiwi in the house. Any of my AKAs? I got your pink and green, girls. So, yeah, there's that. So, pretty good. $1.50. All right. They had nerve to have... Where did I get this at? I got this at Ross. They had the blending sponges for 4 bucks. Okay, so I got this blending brush. I'm assuming that it's going to work great. I mean... In my opinion, I think all of these types of things are all the same. If not, it was just four dollars. So, got the blending brush raw from Ross, and then I could not believe they had these, and I actually have not had any time to go back because I was going to get some more of these to give away for Christmas. But they had the jeweled compacts at Big Lot for three dollars. Now, this doesn't look like anything like right now in the packaging, right? Oh, but see, see, oh, wait until I open this baby up for you girls. All right, it comes nicely packaged. And this is the uh, three times, one times mirror. So basically, uh, it has a enhancement on one side and then just a regular mirror, mirror on the other side. But look at the packaging. Look how it comes in the nice little bag here. And then, check this out. Is this not posh? Can you believe that this was $3? I could not believe this. Look at this. This is nice and sturdy acrylic. And then you open it up. And look how huge these mirrors are. I mean, just like... Oh, yes, darling. Mm -hmm. Lovely. Lovely, lovely. $3. So I got a white one. They had two colors, white and black. All right, so I got that one. And then the black, however, has more of a rubber feel, feel as opposed to acrylic. The black one is more rubbery, which I love. I hope that they have these when I go back tomorrow because I'm giving all of my divas one of these for Christmas as a part of their Christmas package. Okay, check this out. Oh, and of course it came in a little black bag as well. Check this out. Look at that. Do you see this? I mean, I'm freaking out because they were only $3. And they are so classy. And they're so huge. Look at this. I love it. 
I just love, love, love shopping. I love it. Okay, so there's that. We're almost done. Now, I love to read books. I do collect books as well. And so the Dollar General has really, really unique kind of books. Books that you typically might not get, but for a dollar, why not? So they had this book, How to Live with a Man. Ladies, I read a little bit of advice in this book already. And, I mean, they they have some pretty valid suggestions in here. And so, yeah, this was a dollar. And then this one is called Jeff Garland, My Footprint, Carrying the Weight of the World. And basically, <laughs> this is a guy that was once very, very big, and he went on a, a weight loss journey. And I read some, um, you know, chapters, oh, not really chapters, but a few little um, paragraphs here in the book and I really do like some of the things that he was saying uh, this it was just like a lot of funny advice and things that worked for him and just kind of like the reality of you know being a big person in America and trying to lose weight and the things that we go through and so I think that this is going to be a really good read uh, to take to the coffee shop what have you and just have fun so yeah these were a dollar each and then I went to a little, um, you know, those little shoe places that, you know, the boots and shoes purses are like, you know, 15 20 sometimes $10. Well, I found some boots, and these were on, clear, not clearance, but on sale for $19.99. They were $34.99. And I needed some boots similar, well, not really similar, but, you know, this style here. So they're pretty high. There's that, and they got the cute little buckle by the ankle there. They're um, kind of like a little square toe, if you will. And these are going to look really, really cute with tights, with leggings. They even have a little bit of animal print on the inside. Cute. And so I thought for 20 bucks, go ahead and get them. I wanted a brown pair too, but of course they were sold out, and so I'll, I'll check back another time. But I really, really love love these boots here all right last but not least i went to the burlington coat factory and um i don't know if i should save this i might i'm going to show you them now but check out i'm going to be doing a really cool little video with hello kitty but i was in a hello kitty mood like i normally do once a year get like massively in love with hello kitty again i'm never out of love with her but it seems like one time a year i just like spend a whole week getting hello kitty stuff okay so this was last week i was in that mood and i got some hello kitty stuff this is one thing that i want to show you that you just got to you just have to see hello kitty slippers but these are boots these are like Hello Kitty boots that you wear around in the house. And then they have like the little Hello Kitty, where is it, the little button here. Isn't that cute? And then they have like the grips on the bottom. So when I'm taking my little dog Cognac outside to relieve himself, I can be Hello kitty out. So cute. I love Hello Kitty. And uh, these were $10.99. All right, guys, so I'm going to go ahead and end there. I am so happy that I got this stuff done and I was able to show you. I'm going to end there. Have a wonderful week. You know I'm going to. Remember that pretty is as pretty does, and I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys. Mwah.